Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to another Matamo video. How's it going everybody? Guys, today is something important I really want to talk about with everybody. Because in all honesty, I haven't seen anybody bigger than me talk about it. I haven't really seen anybody really talk about it if it's been brought up briefly. Not an actual video. But guys, I think we've come to the point in Madden where this year we're the only packs you're gonna be able to buy with coins is gonna be the pro pack they dropped the team of the week uh, pack today a bundle even and it's 500 uh, Madden cash no way to buy them with coins no nothing which is so crazy because I had seen the other packs in store we'll go ahead and hop over to the marketplace check out the store and we'll just hop over to the packs the kickoff pack I was like okay you know 400 Madden cash that makes sense um, it's like to be you know like kick the kickoff you know the long shot pack I was like okay that's Madden cash and then we got the all Madden pack which really reminded me of um, of last year where it was I think a hundred the all gold player pack which was a hundred K in coins which you can't even buy it's, it's a thousand Madden cash and now the team of the weeks which if I'm right the team of the weeks were somewhere between 50 K and 75 K for a pack and you could buy them with coins you can't do that anymore and bro that that's I feel like EA is really like F us this time because if you can't if you all you can do is buy pro packs with coins it's eventually gonna come to the point where what about when like the BCA packs come out you can't pull BCA players out of pro packs what about when most feared comes and uh, the freaking you know all these other promos that are gonna come and you can't buy these guys with coins all you can buy with coins at the moment is the pro pack all rookie pack rookie pack that's it you, I would have thought by the time they released Team of the Week that you were at least going to be able to buy those with coins. But it doesn't seem like it's happening. Like bundles, of course, have always cost Madden Cash. I understand they've been giving out more Madden Cash. Like by grinding and being able to achieve it, right? Like I could buy a Team of the Week pack right now if I really wanted to. But like it's... I think it's messed up that you can't buy them with coins like what if I wanted to just pull some packs with coins you know a team of the week pack to try to make some different kind of profit I feel like they've literally done it to the point where it's like if you want to waste like coins it's only on the pro pack you want to buy any of our special packs you got to buy it with cash and you can't buy it with cash like we got to buy the bundles you got to Look at that, the prices on the cash, you know, it's pretty expensive. So it's like five bucks every time you want to open a pack. So all those people that do, you know, the huge team of the week bundles and like the huge team of the week pack openings, well, you know, a lot of that's going to stop a lot of the content that comes out of being able to do it to coins. And I feel like EA does it at the end of the day it's to stop coin buying and coin selling it pretty much limits you and it's at this point it's like we don't want y'all to buy coins we don't want to have like a lot of coins in the market we want you guys to buy these packs and I feel like that's that's what it's come down to at this point usually they would always give you the bundle that of course cost Madden cash and then they would um, give you just a regular old pack and yes, you could buy it with cash and then it had like the, exactly how the pro pack has like the slash for you to buy it with coins. And if there's anybody out there who's bigger than me that's watching this video, you know, share it out. That That's so crazy because there's people that just grind it up and they don't just want to buy pro packs. They want to be able to buy the team of the week packs. You know, maybe they pulled something good out of a pro pack and they want to be able to pull... Um, a freaking team of the week pack 
but you you can't do it. You have to buy it with cash. So I don't know, guys. Like, let me know what you guys think. I'm pretty sure a lot of people will not even see this video. It won't get out to a lot of people because YouTube is so dumb nowadays. Most of the people subscribed to me don't even get notifications of my videos. But I just thought it was so important to talk about because eventually it's going to make the difference, guys. As we start rolling into, you know, these promos that come in and it's like you could be able to buy, you know, like BCA packs with coins, most fear packs with coins. It's going to come to a point where EA is going to do it. You can't buy anything with coins except for the pro pack. And as the odds go on, the chances of pulling last year, you couldn't even pull an ultimate legend from a pro pack. So are we getting nerfed? Yeah, they gave us like these crazy overalls, but I don't know, guys. I'm super interested to know what do you guys think about this? My thoughts, I feel like EA is like giving us the finger. And forcing us to, you know, have to buy, like, any better packs with, with Madden Cash. The same thing, the Ultimate Legend packs came out this weekend. And those were only, you were only able to pay, like, with cash. I don't know if you could pull any Ultimate, Le like, any Legends. Not Ultimate Legends, any Legends from the Pro Packs that just came out. I don't know, guys. It's, it's pretty messed up. And I really wanted to make this video. I want to know what you guys think. Um, will it change? Will we eventually be able to buy these packs with coins? This pack usually would cost like 100k. Now we can only buy it with Madden Cash. I'm definitely interested in what you guys think. Shoot me a like if you like the video. Subscribe, guys, if you're new. And I appreciate you guys watching this one. Definitely something that I really wanted to talk about and bring up the topic. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys.